Welcome to English Practice Every Day. Today we will understand the meaning of five phrasal verbs and learn how to use them in simple sentences. Let's start. Please speak out loud with me. Phrasal verbs we will learn today are 1. Get after. Get after. 2. Get along. Get along. 3. Get across. Get across. 4. Get around. Get around. 5. Get away. Get away. 1. Get after. Get after. Meaning to chase someone, a person or an animal. Often told as an order. Get after means to chase someone, a person or an animal. Often told as an order. In sentences, this phrase is used as gets after, getting after, got after. Gets after, getting after, got after. Get after Mary and tell her to finish this report by noon. Get after Mary and tell her to finish this report by noon. Tell the kids to stop getting after that poor cat. Tell the kids to stop getting after that poor cat. Second meaning of get after is to keep asking someone to do something or to keep telling how to do something. Second meaning of get after is to keep asking someone to do something or to keep telling how to do something. Jean was getting after Mary with his marriage proposal. Jean was getting after Mary with his marriage proposal. My mother was getting after us to clean our room. My mother was getting after us to clean our room. Get after is often used with about. Get after about. I should get after the mechanic about my car service. I should get after the mechanic about my car service. You must stop getting after your friends about their lives. You must stop getting after your friends about their lives. Meaning, stop telling them how to live their lives. Second phrase is get along. Get along. Get along means to be friendly with someone or liking someone. Get along means to be friendly with someone or liking someone. In sentences, this phrase is used as gets along, getting along, got along. Gets along, getting along, got along. My dog and my neighbor's cat are getting along very well. My dog and my neighbor's cat are getting along very well. Fire and water do not get along. Fire and water do not get along. Get along is often used with with. Get along with. Get along with. I do not get along with arrogant people. I do not get along with arrogant people. After their nasty fight, Jean and Mary are not getting along with each other. After their nasty fight, Jean and Mary are not getting along with each other. Second meaning of get along is to deal with a situation, especially successfully. Second meaning of get along is to deal with a situation, especially successfully. How are you getting along with your English fluency? How are you getting along with your English fluency? It was difficult for John to get along without his wife after her demise. It was difficult for John to get along without his wife after her demise. Third phrase, get across. Get across. Get across means to successfully communicate with others. Get across means to successfully communicate with others. In sentences, this phrasal verb is used as gets across, getting across got across gets across getting across got across a smart writer gets across plenty of ideas in just few lines a smart writer gets across plenty of ideas in just few lines he was a brilliant actor who got across difficult human emotions to his audience he was a brilliant actor who got across difficult human emotions to his audience Fourth phrasal verb is get around. Get around. Get around means to travel to different places. 
get around means to travel to different places. In sentences, this phrasal verb is used as gets around, getting around, got around. Gets around, getting around, got around. First Asia, then Europe, then Africa. You certainly get around. First Asia, then Europe, then Africa. You certainly get around. Getting around is what Mary has planned after her retirement. Getting around is what Mary has planned after her retirement. Another meaning of this phrasal verb get around is if news or information gets around, it means a lot of people hear about it. If news or information gets around, it means a lot of people hear about it. It is getting around that John and Mary are getting married. It is getting around that John and Mary are getting married. Word gets around quickly if the news is unfortunate. Word gets around quickly if the news is unfortunate. Fifth phrasal verb is get away. Get away. Get away means to leave a place or person, especially when it is difficult to do. Get away means to leave a place or person, especially when it is difficult to do. In sentences, this phrasal verb is used as gets away, getting away, got away. Gets away, getting away, got away. What time did you finally get away from the noisy party? What time did you finally get away from the noisy party? Last night I got away quickly from the traffic. Last night I got away quickly from the traffic. Another meaning of this phrasal verb get away is to escape, sometimes used with with, get away with. Another meaning of this phrase is to escape, sometimes used with with, get away with, get away with. The tiger ran after the deer, but it got away. The tiger ran after the deer, but it got away. The robber got away with a stolen car. The robber got away with a stolen car. He is so charming he will even get away with a murder. He is so charming he will even get away with a murder. So to rewind, we learned and understood five phrasal verbs today. 1. Get after. 2. Get along. 3. Get across. 4. Get around. And 5. Get away. Please keep practicing them until the next time when we pick up five more phrasal verbs and master them. Bye for now.